Five, four, three, two, one, and liftoff of Tom Marshburn, Ramon Romanenko, and Chris Hatfield making their way towards the International Space Station. I was struck by the power of the rockets as they took off, uh, which is impressive. And uh, then when you get the figures of the, the speed at which they're traveling and the distance they are going, one is particularly conscious of the uh, great science and technology that lies behind this. Before it was officially announced, we kind of knew this was coming. Chris was going to be assigned. Chris is going to be commander, probably, perhaps, most certainly. And then, yes, he got assigned as a commander. So we're all behind him, like a huge team, tens of thousands of people that are behind this mission. Everybody sees the astronaut, of course, but there's a whole army of people to make this safe and successful. And for me, personally, this is a big deal because I'm a rookie in this business. Chris is one of my mentors, a very generous man. So to see someone like that, this uh, this figure being honored in this way is a great motivation. Just now coming up on the six minute mark of powered flight. The only experience, only advice that I passed on to Chris is to make sure you take time to enjoy the, the moment. You know, there's a lot of um, professional aspects of flying on an expedition, but there's a lot of personal aspects as well. So enjoy your crewmates, enjoy the view out the window, do wild and crazy astronaut tricks when you have spare time, and fly around like Superman. Make sure you uh, enjoy that because that's what you'll miss when you come home.